So the idea is to use some processes when the model starts becoming hard to understand. So when there are too many modeling constructs. As a rule of thumb, we should not go beyond 30 flow objects, where flow objects are activities, events, and gateways. As it has been empirically shown that above this threshold, there is an increased error probability. So we want to use a processes to simplify the model and reduce the probability of committing errors, for example, of creating models with deadlocks, or more in general, with behavioral anomalies. So we could have at least three levels of modeling abstraction, where at the top level we put the value chain, on level two we hide the main decisions and hands-off, so we represent the process model with the main decisions and handoffs by using lanes, and then on level three and below we add procedural aspects, such as parallel flows, data objects and data stores, we handle exceptions, and we add as much detail as it is relevant. So let's not forget that we should not overdo this, we should not pollute the model with elements that are not relevant for the modeling purpose, the target audience, and clearly the modeling subject. So there are indeed two drivers for the composition, logical, grouping elements on the basis of some common business object all these elements are working on, for example raw materials, and also a structural driver, like whenever we reach this threshold as a rule of thumb of 30, then we should be seeking opportunities for collapsing parts of the model into sub-processes.